Northeast Independent School District is in San Antonio area. In 2011, we wrote into our bond that we wanted interactive whiteboards so we could get students up and engaged into the classroom and not have the teacher always the one on the stage. That's what our kids are hungry for, is the interaction piece. It's no longer sit at a desk and have a worksheet. That's not gonna cut it for keeping their attention. And with that, now we've placed a smart board in every instructional classroom. Having two smart boards has been phenomenal. And then I can also access smart board from the iPads using the smart app. Now the way they're always up at the board, manipulating information, not just looking at information, creating products, at the board, at different devices. They are not just consumers anymore, they're producers of knowledge and products that are meaningful. Oh. Yeah. We just need to let loose and let the kids go with it. And that way the teacher can organize and orchestrate and facilitate the learning and not necessarily have to be the one embedded in the teaching. They can come up with the questions, they can come up with the answers, and then I'm just there as backup in case they need me. Their fine motor skills are not as developed at the kinder level, so if they're able to click a button or do something fast, they tend to stay on a task longer. They're like, I could do this all day, and depending on what we're learning, we change it up all the time, and so it's always exciting. There's lots of different things that you can choose from, like games and math activities and ABC things, and it's just so much fun. It's not just the elementary level that gets excited, it's even in the secondary level. Ooh, very nice. A lot of the kids come in my classroom not liking math. And so part of teaching is to teach them algebra, but also to teach them to really love math. And one of the ways we hook them into loving math is doing fun games. We got this with a brain. It's a team effort, so we work together. A student might teach another student better than I would. Not only do they help you if you don't know it, but you also get to help them, so it helps you both ways. The kids get more involved, they get more excited about learning, and they just understand the concepts better when they are able to interact with them. They are so into technology, whether it be video games or anything like that, so it, it comes naturally to them. The teacher's changing their perspective of it's okay to ask the students how to do something because uh, they don't know, but they're not afraid to try and figure it out. And that's one of the big differences. If sometimes if we can get out of the way, the kids can have a whole different learning experience. Because the district continues to invest in the technology, we're able to push, you know, those kinds of bounds and be able to kind of stay more on the cutting edge of what we're doing. If I were to go to another school that didn't have a smart board, at least a smart board, I would feel a little bit behind the times. You know, it's interactive, it's easy, it lends itself to what's already going on in education, it doesn't take away from things, and I just don't see the classroom of the future without that technology in it.